Hello everyone, we are pretty much at the end of December of 2022. We're going to say this year uh, goodbye forever. Just wanted to bring your attention towards two things. If you are still thinking about the market is going to crash, so two things you should keep in mind. Days on market, which means how long the property stays in the market before it sells. And number two is the month of inventory, which means how much inventory, how much properties are available right now to sell. Does it take one month, two months, three months, how long it takes to finish up all the inventory so if i look back in september october and november so the days on market was 14 in september 14 in october and november was 15 so that's the days on market which means the property are selling within two weeks number two when we look at the months of inventory in september we were like 2.69 which means it's gonna take 2.69 months to consume every property available in gta to be sold and in october it was 2.63 and in november was 2.62 it was reducing so that tells us that the months of inventory is reducing in the last three months days on the market is actually very consistent within two weeks which means not a lot so whatever comes in the market is getting pretty much consumed or equivalent of that amount is getting consumed that gives me an indication the house prices may or may not shift towards or maybe we stay stagnant and that's what we see in last four months in row also we see that the prices are pretty much flattened they are not going down anymore in GTA so stay tuned and keep an eye on the market if you wanted to start your journey of investing in 2023 on a strong footing. Have a good one. Happy New Year. We'll talk soon. Bye-bye.